It's so funny that we saw that. I literally talked earlier and said, Buddy Heal doesn't fix the defensive woes, but the first two players they went out and got in free agency, D. Anthony Milton and Kyle Anderson, are defensive specialists. Buddy Heald, you know, is an Iron Man. He never misses games. Yeah, some people are going to say, well, he went to the Sixers and tried to be like, have a bigger role and it flopped. But he showed he can be a little bit of a playmaker. He can score off the dribble. He's one of the best three point shooters. And I always made a joke about this past season to people. I was like, what's the big difference between Buddy Heald and Clay Thompson on offense at this point? Buddy Heald, you know, natural born shooter, one of the most reliable three point shooters in the league. They're getting him in a sign in trade. He's not afraid to shoot. He can finish in transition. He's become a better ball handler. And he he's not going to be creating his own shot or be like a lot. He's not like a cone on defense, but he'll be hunted. I just think this is a really good pickup for them. It, he's just perfect. I, I've never I've I, I think this is just perfect because he just spits what they needed. They needed more three point shooting. And he comes in, and that's exactly what he gives them. Three-point shooting in volume. And to me, they're a team that, if you looked at the Warriors roster currently, I think they've gone out and they've gotten a lot of players that you know help them in the front court and help them have more size. And I think Buddy Heald's another one. They needed some more shooting to replace. Clay Thompson, they go and get the guy who's Basically, in the last 10 years, the most three-pointers go Steph Curry, Klay Thompson, Buddy Heald. So not a bad guy to replace Klay Thompson with. And now you have Steph Curry, Klay, not Klay, but Steph Curry, D'Anthony Milton, B-Pod, Buddy Heald, Gary Payton, Lindy Waters, Andrew Wiggins, Moses Moody, Guy Santos, Jonathan Kaminga, Kyle Anderson, Draymond Green, Trace Jackson Davis, and Kevon Looney. Hey, I, I might not be a mathematician, but I I feel like that's a pretty good deal. The Golden Golden State Warriors sign and trade for Buddy Heald is a great deal. Great, great, great deal. Now it all comes down to like when you look at this roster, is you you seem B pod and Moses Moody are going to have to take the jump. You hope Wiggins and Gary Payton can stay healthy. I think D, D. Milton's a good, you know, D. Anthony Milton's a good insurance policy. Same thing with Lindy Waters and Guy Santos. I like the front court of Draymond Green, Trace Jackson Davis, Kevon Looney, and then he sprinkled in a little Kyle Anderson in there. But besides that, what do you guys think? I, I, I think it's definitely interesting to see how, you know, this team has gone out. I think they've done a good job of adding veterans. They're they have a good mix of young guys that they can they know that they can rely upon. And I don't know. What do you what do you guys think? Is this just me being a little excited or over too excited? Because I think this is a good team. And and I don't know. I just feel like some people are going to be like, oh, he's going to be a 20-point-per-game scorer. I think he's just going to give him 12 points a night, provide some three-point shooting. I just don't want to act like he's this great signing that's going to be a game-changer. Like, was it a good signing? Yes, it was a good signing. But I'm not sitting here and saying that they've replaced Klay Thompson with Buddy Heald. They got someone who plays, who is going to be a very good job at mimicking what Clay Thompson at this point in his career was giving you. And I can be sarcastic and all that stuff, but we all know Clay's one of one. So it's it's going to be quite hard to replace that. You don't you don't replace that in my opinion. And at this point in at if they could get someone like a Lowry Market in I don't know how you would, but I, I I still do believe that they're a player away from being really good. That's it for me. I hope you guys did enjoy. Like, comment, subscribe if you guys enjoyed this video. And if you did, just let me know.
I don't know. That's it. I'm out. You out. Wow. Bye.